November 2nd, back out here at school, ring hunting. Just got another ring, first ring of the day. Freaking plated. <laughs> nice looking ring if it wasn't plated. A little bit of plating left on it. But we'll take it. It's still a ring. Not the, quite the consistent color I want. It'll work. Grayson Digger over here coming down to say hey. He's coming to join me. Uh, thanks for looking. Happy hunting. We'll get back to you and find a good one or any other ring. Uh, found a couple more uniform buttons, a couple quarters. All right. Thanks for looking. Got me a little earring. That's Mark 925. I see it there. That'll work. At least piece of silver for today. Junk ring and silver, I'll take it. See if we can find some more. Thanks for looking happy hunting. We'll get back to you later. All right, there's another earring. Appears to be silver too. Clean it up and double check, but pretty sure that's silver. Thanks for looking happy hunting. I don't know if Rob ain't got anything. He ain't said nothing. He's way on the other end of the field. It's pretty cool. At least two pieces of silver today. Thanks for looking. Back to find anything else. November 5th, um, came to school because I was going to a house that uh, I want to get permission for, but nobody's home, and usually he's home during the day. Got second target, silver ring. Yeah, looks like I nicked it to the sidewall. That's an older one there. Let's see if it's what marks are inside. Caked on dirt. We'll clean it up later, look at it. But, oops, it's only just a couple inches down. Thanks for looking, happy hunting. All right, guys, never gonna believe this. I don't know what to call this one. Thought it was a piece of aluminum. I wiped it off, just because it was crap. That is a barber half, what's left of one. What in the heck? I guess it's barber. I don't know. I had to. That might be something different. I don't know, but I'd like to find the rest of that. <laughs> it's absolutely odd. That ain't no barber. Not the back of it like that. Let's see if it's a focus. Hang on. Let me get a spit shine here. Uh, let's see if I can get this better here. All right. Any help? I don't know what that was at one time. Whatever it is, it hole blown through it or something. That is odd. It's about five, six inches down. Screaming 1244, 1248 on the CTX. Yeah, it's still a chunk of silver though. I don't know if to count this as a full coin or not though. We'll let y'all decide. Thanks for looking. Happy hunting. All right, do a wrap up over at school. Got uh, five quarters, a couple dimes and pennies, three Wheaties, and you saw the ring. This little silver ring with turquoise in it. It's older. It's worn smooth inside. You can barely see where it looks like it said sterling. Can't hard to get it. Then here's the, I think it's a, I don't know, you tell me, I don't know what it is. I'm thinking a crown maybe, but Let's see if this will focus in on it. The date is 1869. Dang, I wish that was whole. <laughs> That's awesome. I'll take it though. And yes, I'm going to call it a coin. So that should be, I think, 95 for the year. Um, That's absolutely awesome. I just wish I could have found the rest. I'm going to still look. Could be on the other side. I think it was hit by a trench or yeah, ditch witch trenching tool when they're putting in power lines and stuff uh, years ago. But I think that's a ditch witch hit it, chewed it up, spit the other half somewhere. It may have just totally destroyed the other part. 
But that's awesome, 1869. That'd be my oldest silver. Um, school keeps giving and giving. It's it's amazing. When I think there ain't gonna be nothing else, it surprises me. So we'll see. Thanks for looking. Happy hunting, and we'll get back to you later.